probably need to come. <laughs> no, it's an amazing spot where you are here. So it's amazing. I realise it's a place. Yeah, yeah. wait till you see what we've got outside. Excellent. Come in. Because this is a building where we can really create that space for men to feel safe and welcome. Yeah. Did you have to do it online for some of the sessions? We moved temporarily. It's um, but it what a spot. I mean it's I hadn't realised you got cricket and rugby right on the doorstep in the busy yeah. heart of London. It's a, it's a cracking spot. And Rob, we're all delivering that therapy already, so yeah. we wanted to maybe... And I hear that your that clients come in tomorrow, effectively. It's kind yeah. of literally get us out and <laughs> bring yeah, us tomorrow. Really soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's a really exciting time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> absolutely. And we spoke, but there's a few elements to um, this space. Physical so, location. Yeah, yeah, and it's... This will... Uh, can I introduce Derek Wilson and Sarah? Hello, right, can I get to you? Nice to meet you. Hello. Nice to meet you. Please grab a seat. Have a seat. Sit down. There's no room in the inn at the last one. <laughs> <laughs> yes, <actually. laughs> so we've been able to use over the last sort of four years, which is, this is our intervention, this is what we use with the, the men who come along. Um, um, because, as you know, males don't speak about, mm. the, about these issues. You should help yourself. Have you felt that you had to manage it all yourself? Is that true? No, I didn't know I had an issue, Shane. Yeah. I, I, like, <laughs> I didn't know I had an issue. I didn't know I had an issue. Male particularly male suicide part is back, is, is how, do we, how do we get to people before and help them understand that you know, you're at a crisis point now and, we, and, and some support is necessary versus, no, I'm okay, I can do this, there's nothing wrong. Okay, so how, do we, how do we do that? Well, uh, I think a way that I don't think most people get to do. So I think if people go and see psychologists and therapists, they, they will do that, but most of us don't. Most of us don't sort of seek out therapy. Um, and you certainly have, actually. Yeah, yeah. So, so one of the things that Anna, and he told me about some of the things that he was thinking, And then he told me about some of the things he was doing, so he wasn't speaking to anybody, mm -hmm. didn't we? And he told me about some of the things he was feeling, so you're feeling angry, you're feeling guilty, you're feeling quite trapped. Um, you know, so, and Sarah said, I told you so. <laughs> 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 I would exactly. never do that. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, yeah. it was amazing yeah, to me, just a, a set of simple... James Place and everyone has accomplished here is another, you know, milestone. And I know what is your journey um, to making sure um, men have access to mental health support and, and suicide prevention. So I'm, I'm really, I'm, I'm always touched and I'm always incredibly moved by my visits to, um, to places, knowing that there's something here for, for guys to come to.